Hey folks, AJ the CEO here, and I want to do this video because I've had a lot of y'all, um, thankfully, buy my OBS bundle version 3, and I keep seeing this um, message come to me either on Messenger, a DM, or an email, and people are having issues with not showing the files and everything. So let me go ahead and walk you through this again. This is not an error. It's just that you've extracted the files in a different location. I thought I did this in another video, but hey, it doesn't matter. We're just going to do this again to hopefully help y'all get this all sorted out. All right, so we have OBS here. Let me go ahead and I have my download here of our files. Now, the way I've made this is for this to be extracted into your C directory. So I will go back and extract it how normally I would like how it's been set up to do. I would just take this and just pull it right there on the C drive, let it expand out. And then the folder lives right there on your C drive if this is Windows. Um, Mac is actually has to do the same thing I'm getting ready to show y'all how to do. So say if I do it this way, we would just come in here, we would import our scene. We go all the way over to where we extracted our files on the C drive. We pick the JSON file, we import it, give it a second, and now there's our OBS version three. And all of our stuff shows up fine because it's looking at that direction. But what I see that is happening, and again, it's nothing to matter with this, I just want to walk through how this was set up. So let's go ahead and completely delete this folder. And let's actually extract it right here in my downloads folder. So I'll just put it right there to my downloads. All right. So now that is where the file is. So if I come back here into OBS, go to our scene collection, go to import. Now we need to navigate over to our downloads folder, and that's where the file is. We import it, give it a second, go to the scene collection, and look, we got a whole bunch of quote-unquote errors. They're not errors. They're just missing files because it's looking for where this path is supposed to be where I set it to the seed um, folder on um, right there, and then the folder is there. You put it somewhere else, it just can't find them. That's all it means. So all we're going to do is point to where we put it. So let's just select um, one of these or just go search directory here at the bottom. We're going to go to our downloads, pick the folder, and then select folder and see it didn't find anything. So we need to go a little bit deeper for each folder. So we're going to go to assets, and I think that is under countdowns. And we select that folder and see, look, it found the files. And now we just got to go through and map every one of these to where they're going. See, I went to um, videos. It found a bunch of them. We have some more that we got to do. Let's search again. And it's going to be under images. A bunch more have been found. Motivational. This is going to be under music. So we just search that again under assets on the music and we're missing these videos but everything else has been found we'll just pick one of these search again and i believe that is on the backgrounds and look all of our files are now found we get apply and everything is working that's all that is that message is popping up that just means that you've extracted the files in a completely different location than how i originally set it up if you don't want to do that, that's perfectly fine. You just now have to map every single file over to where their location is. That's the same thing that needs to happen when you do your um, animated lower thirds and everything. You need to point to wherever they've been extracted to. So I hope that helps. Um, really straightforward. It's not an error or anything like that. It's not that you did anything wrong. You just put it in a different location, which is perfectly fine for you to do. Um, I hope that helps. And that's about it. So if you like this type of content, appreciate a like, consider subscribing, hit that bell. That way you get notified when we come out with other videos to help modernize your media ministry. Thanks for watching, folks. This is AJ. Catch you on the next video. Later. <laughs>